Scientology Center. Something I have noticed with the video blogs, you really need to keep a, a good attitude, you know? I mean, people don't really want to watch you when you are when you have a bad day or when you're in a bad mood. So you just kind of got to plow through it and do what you can to, you know, make it enjoyable for your viewers. That's tough sometimes. It's, it's tough to keep the attitude up. And I know I haven't always done it. I've, I've just not been in a very good mood lately. A lot of it has to do with not having a job and a lot of it has to do with not being near the woman I love. That's tough. With the way that things are today and the economy is bad, I know everyone says, oh, we have a bad economy and everything, but it's true, you know? I'm a highly qualified individual and I've been unemployed for over a month now. It's a hard time to be out there looking for jobs and try and make it. And a lot of the video bloggers that I do watch, you know, aren't in the same position that I am. They aren't struggling and they aren't just making it paycheck to paycheck. It's like almost living off charity at this point. And that's hard. It's it's really tough uh, to keep up a good attitude. But you gotta, you gotta keep up a good attitude. You have to keep the camera rolling, you know. It, it makes it difficult to, to be able to get up and, and do a vlog every week and be, you know, smiley and, and have a good time. Okay, so it's not Friday, it is Saturday. Let me explain myself. Here's what happened. So yesterday I uh, left and had an interview with um, the restaurant downtown that I'm trying to get a job at and then immediately went to work. So I really didn't, you know, I was out of the house from 2.30 in the afternoon on. Uh, as soon as I got to work, I realized I wasn't going to be able to have enough time to do my video yesterday. So I just kind of said, fuck it, and decided to do it today. For you, I have a little clip of the show, which, sorry about the bad quality, but it was filmed on my phone and not on my camera, so it is off quality. Turns out there was a party after work, so we went to the party, and I didn't end up getting home until about 5 in the morning. After the show, we hopped the train where we saw a Hank Azaria lookalike and went to the party. This place was fucking fantastic. The loft was called the... The, the Inconvenience. I can never remember the name. The Inconvenience. They actually do theater stuff there, apparently. And um, there is 11 people that live in the, this loft, and it is just absolutely massive. There were probably about 150 people at the party total. Um, tons of people, and still plenty of room to just hang out and get around. Wasn't even packed by any, you know, by any means. Um, and I didn't get home till like 5 o'clock in the morning when I was absolutely exhausted and too exhausted to edit my video and put it up. So I just went to bed and woke up this afternoon and decided to do this now. So I apologize for the tardiness, but it was a good time. And uh, yeah, that's all I have for you this week. Max, I will see you on Monday. No, no, I won't be anywhere.